Hello everybody, E here. Welcome back to another book review. Today we are talking about Lot by Brian Washington. This is a fantastic book. Um, one thing that made me grab it off Book of the Month Club to begin with was the cover. Uh, I think it's an exceptional cover. Uh, it is artwork and I always appreciate artwork over just like a face with a title on it. Um, and another thing that drew me in was is, uh, it was a collection of interconnected stories. So the, 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 main, sto the main stories I liked in here, um, the, nothing, I didn't dislike anything, um, but I absolutely loved certain stories. Uh, Bayou was exceptional. Um, it's about two, two boys that find a uh, chupacabra. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> um, it was a really fun story, um, especially their interactions with the thing. Now, these aren't horror stories. This is literary fiction. Uh, the whole collection is amazingly written. Um, easily going to be one of my favorites this year. Uh, I took my time with it. I read it over the course of probably about 20, 22 days, something like that. Um, almost... I, I want to I'll probably say it was three weeks um, on and off. I didn't read a story every single day. Sometimes I split the days up. Um, unfortunately, the, the story that I didn't like the most is the longest story in here. Um, I think it's called Wog. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, or Wa. W-A-U-G-H. When I lived in Maine, I believe there was a place called Wog um, that that's how you pronounce it, but it might be something different here, because I think this one takes place in Texas, um, but, uh, or Houston, I believe, because they talk about, I know they talk about Houston, um, some of the stuff is not ambiguous, but some of the stuff, just, there's just no names to go along with it, um, another one that I liked was, uh, Navigation was another favorite of mine, uh, all of these stories are great, um, the one thing that I would say, uh, watch out for is that, that, uh, that, not the ambiguity, um, some of the stuff is a little too obscure, um, too vague, uh, that'd be the one thing, um, if you look for stories with, uh, pl with hard plots, uh, strict plots, strict adherence to plots, mm -hmm. this is probably not for you. This book is more about the language um, and the, the the beauty of the prose than it is about anything else. Uh, there are heavy LGBTQ um, themes, uh, so if you're interested in that, it's definitely something to pick up. Uh, there's a there's a there's a passion here that um, I especially appreciated. You can feel the heart in the writing. Um, but they, I'm giving it five stars, I and mean, there's absolutely nothing wrong with this. And even the, the uh, novella length, or maybe it's more like a novelette, but the, even the longest story in here has its merits. It's just I didn't as, enjoy it as much as I enjoyed some of the other ones. Um, all of the relationships in this book are done very, very well. If you like uh, reading about characters... Um, People who people the characters that feel real. If you like reading about the that type of a thing without a heavy plot, then you are going to really enjoy this book. But until next time, I have been E, you've been you. This has been another book review. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.